Hi everyone, it's Emma Noel. I wanted to share with you this amazingly powerful spiritual warfare prayer that I found online and it works wonders. It just leaves you with this overwhelming feeling of love and happiness and peace. So I'm going to leave the words on the screen here so you can read along with me if you'd like to pray with me. Father, in Jesus' name, by prayer and faith, I put on your whole armor that I may stand against the wiles of the devil. I put on your helmet of salvation. Let the same mind be in me that is in Christ Jesus. I put on your breastplate of righteousness, the righteousness of Christ. I put on the girdle of truth. Jesus is the way, the truth, and the life. John 14, 6. The truth integrity and holiness of God I put on your sandals of the gospel of peace help us to stand on the solid ground of Jesus above all I put on your shield of faith to quench every fiery dart arrow spear missile the enemy shoots our way and Lord I put on your precious sword of the spirit your holy word that's alive and powerful sharper than any two-edged sword Hebrews 4:12 our offensive and defensive weapon job 110 have you not made a hedge around him around his household and around all that he has on every side you have blessed the work of his hands and his possessions have increased in the land father in the name of jesus i ask you to keep the same hedge of protection around me my family my mind my heart and emotions as it is written in job 110 Psalm 34, 7, The angel of the Lord encampeth round about them that fear him, and delivereth them. Psalms 91, 11, and 12, For he shall give his angels charge over thee, to keep thee in all thy ways. They shall bear thee up in their hands, lest thou dash thy foot against a stone. Father, in Jesus' name, I ask you to keep an encampment of your powerful angels around me 24 hours a day. Hebrews 1.14 Are they not all ministering spirits sent forth to minister for those who will inherit salvation? Father, in Jesus' name, I ask you to send a host of ministering angels, in addition to the one each believer has, to minister to our hurts, needs, pains, and infirmities, strengthening us in every way. Zechariah 2.5 For I, says the Lord, will be a wall of fire all around her, and I will be the glory in her midst. Father, I just praise you and thank you that your glory is my rear guard. Isaiah 52.12 and 58.8 In Jesus' name, I ask you to surround me with your supernatural wall of fire, to insulate me from any assaults of the devil. Genesis 15.1 After these things, the word of the Lord came to Abram in a vision, saying, Do not be afraid, Abram. I am your shield, your exceedingly great reward. Also in Psalms 3.3 3. Father, in Jesus' name, by faith, I claim your promise to be my shield and protector. The mind is Satan's playground. 2 Corinthians 10, 3-5 For though we walk in the flesh, we do not war according to the flesh. For the weapons of our warfare are not carnal, but mighty in God, for pulling down strongholds, casting down arguments, and every high thing that exalts itself against the knowledge of God, bringing every thought into the captivity and obedience of Christ. In the mighty name of Jesus, I command my thoughts to come under the obedience and captivity to Jesus Christ, as it is written in 2 Corinthians 10.5. Matthew 16.19 And I will give you the keys of the kingdom of heaven, and whatever you bind on earth will be bound in heaven, and whatever you loose on earth will be loosed in heaven. Also see Matthew 18.18. In the name of Jesus, the name that is above every name and all things, I bind up every unclean spirit and assignment coming against me, my children and my family, from, by, or through anyone or anything 
named or unnamed, known or unknown, seven generations back. In the name of Jesus, I bind up the principalities, powers, rulers of darkness of this world, spiritual wickedness in high places, and the prince of the power of the air. In Jesus' name, I bind up the strong man, the old man, every prince and stronghold, the spirit of antichrist, every evil spirit and plague, the spirit of confusion, illusion, and delusion. In Jesus' name, I bind up the spirit of infirmity, sickness, disease, pain, addiction, affliction, calamity, and dev the devourer, the destroyer, the accuser, the deceiver, the corrupter, and every spirit of poverty. In the name of Jesus, I bind up the spirit of strife and division, backbiting and gossip, critical and judgmental spirits, spirits of resistance and hindrance, every spirit of retribution, revenge and retaliation, and the lying, seducing, deceiving spirit of deception. 1 Timothy 4, 1 and 2. In the name of Jesus, I bind up every root of fear, doubt, unbelief, discouragement, and every deadly demon, from despair to depression, to the spirit of pride, rebellion, disobedience, self, ego, independence, unforgiveness, bitterness, lust, and the flesh. The Lord Jesus Christ rebuke you, evil, unclean spirits. Jude 9, Zechariah 3, 2. I loose in the name of Jesus Christ, deliverance, freedom, and liberation peace, joy, hope, gladness of heart, love, healing and wholeness, mercy and grace, blessings and favor, restoration of the years that the locusts have eaten, Joel 2.25, the resurrection power of Jesus Christ, a mighty harvest, and a boldness to witness for Christ. Amen and amen. Thank you all so much for praying with me. God bless you.